got? So I decided, I think I talked about it last week. I'm going to do one OS and gifts that I would give an awesome things out of that OS. So this mm-hmm. week it's Android. Um, so today I found Snap, which takes Android widgets and puts them in your system drawer, kind of the pull down drawer mm-hmm. menu. Um, it's free. If you want quick access to three widgets, I'm a huge widget person. I have actually a panel on my tablets and even on my phones in some in some cases, if they're Android, I will actually dedicate an entire page to widgets, um, especially if they're quick widgets for like turning off Bluetooth, turning on Bluetooth, um, automatically setting brightness settings. Um, and then I'll have another widget panel with Twitter feeds and Facebook feeds and quick posts and Google Drive etc 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 so this lets you the the problem is is that every time you're in an app you then have to go back to your home screen to get to these types of things this lets you quickly put three right in that in that drop down um for a for an additional two dollars um you can um remove the the three widget max um and i think it's will give you unlimited i think that's the number um, but cool little, cool little gadget tech toy for, for Android users out there. Um, definitely will come in handy and it's anywhere between free and $2. So it probably comes right in at that right price. If you're using, as long as you're using widgets, which I, I would think that most Android users, if you're using Android, that would be one of the big plays and reasons to use Android. So certainly I, you, you cannot beat android for customizability yes definitely. i mean really it is it, it, it's the power user device i go to if you're the power user man that's it, it, how many people came up to me is like yeah i'm on android now see me with my iphone i was like cool that's it's it's a viable choice mm-hmm. no I, I there's no discount to android it's not the thing for me but you know and and i play with both i, I still have the nexus the nexus is the is the uh poking around on the internet before bed device for me you know uh, and uh, i wish i could find i wish uh, google if you're listening another nexus seven inch device i think would be perfect yeah what the heck <laughs> Please. I mean, it, it was perfect. We got you know, Marshmallow. I don't know if you got your Marshmallow update. I got my Marshmallow update on my... I got it a couple weeks ago, Yeah, I actually. got it a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Um, but I have a feeling that's going to be... The the 2013 7-inch didn't get it. So it was only the second generation mm-hmm. Nexus 7 that got it. Um, and then they jumped... That year they had a 7 and a 9-inch. And then, I mean, it seems like they're, they're kind of going 9 on forward. I feel like there's definitely room for a Nexus 7-inch. I, I don't care who they partner with to make it, whether it's Zeus, LG, Samsung, whomever, I don't care. But a nice day one OS upgraded um, Android device, I think it, there's definitely room for that in the market. 